uh, Coach Chris Samudio, across from Manta Ray, going over butterfly kips. Uh, we're working on butterfly kips either this week or today. So we're going to go over a couple things here, try to make it um, uh, a little bit quick. Uh, what we're doing here is a different rhythm, okay? So uh, teaching me this was really hard. I, I couldn't really get it from the ground, but now that I understand it and I got it from the rig, I can get it from the ground. All right, and what movement that we're doing with, with the leg is kind of a reverse bicycle pedal. So I'm gonna keep my leg uh, totally straight. All right, open hip here. All right, I'm gonna come up. And as soon as I kind of uh, bring my leg up, I'm tucking back, okay, like I'm pedaling backwards. My uh, heel needs to go back past my glute. All right, and then I'm gonna kick back, okay? This is the rhythm that we're, that we're looking for. So you should start kind of slow, just walk through it, because this makes it confusing. Uh, for your brain a little bit, doing a reverse uh, bicycle pedal, okay? Now I can speed it up as I get it. Boom, 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 okay? But start slow, okay? You can't mess up, you don't wanna mess this up. And uh, important when we're up on the bar, okay? When I kick my foot back, I want my hips to actually come up. Boom, so if you can add this into it, all right? Pressing the hip forward. As this goes back, the hip goes forward. So the butterfly kip always starts, unfortunately, with hanging on the bar and looking like a fish for a couple weeks. All right? No one just gets up on the bar and starts knocking out butterfly pull-ups. We've got to hang there. Don't even worry about your pull yet. Okay, we need to get the rhythm. All right? And um, I, call it, uh, I call it knees up, hips out. Okay? Just like we kind of did there, but a little more violent with the hip. Knees up, hips out. As we bring our hips out, my knee comes up. Okay, I'm going to leg straight. Knee comes up. I pop my hips out. Kick the foot back. Knees up, hips out. Knees up hips out. So when I'm up on the bar, I'm going to do the same thing. Coach, if you want to show from the side a little bit. Okay, I'm going to, uh, and I'm not going to worry about how hard up. I'm not even going to try to pull. All I'm going to do is knees up, hips come out a little bit. That's it. If I get one, good. Okay, what you don't want to do is this right here. Okay, so bring your legs straight. Your knees going to come up. You're going to pop your hips out and bring your feet back towards your butt. Knees up, hips out. Knees up, hips out. Knees up, hips out. Knees up, hips out. That's the basis behind the butterfly kick. You have to be able to do that before you pull. Get to a rhythm down here. Now once I get there, I can start pulling a little bit at a time as long as I'm keeping my rhythm. As soon as I lose my rhythm, I'm coming down from the bar. I'm gonna shake it out for a second and reset. Okay, so now I'm gonna start to pull a little bit. All right, feet come forward, knees up, hips out. Knees up, hips out. Knees up, hips out. This would be your second thing. Okay, we have kind of a little pull. I'm still keeping my rhythm. And now when I'm ready to go up chin over the bar, now I'm going to kip hard, I'm going to pull hard, my shin's going to go over the bar, and I'm going to keep my feet moving, okay? So, knees up, hips out. I'm going to start low and turn it into a, a, a full kip, okay? Knees up, hips out, knees up, hips out, knees up, hips out, and now i got my rhythm, okay? It all starts from the bottom. You have to work down, bring it up, and keep that rhythm. Again, when you lose your rhythm, restart, okay? Try a couple reps in a row. Um, I always uh, try to do something called flight simulator where you get five in a row and rest, and then you try to get 10 in a row, and then rest, 15, and then rest, so on. Give yourself a time limit, like five minutes, um, to get as many, to get up as high as you can. Okay, we can do this with a lot of stuff, double unders, um, pull-ups, uh, toes to bar, all right? It's a great way to practice um, for five minutes a day. Okay, every day you get on the bar, you get better.